Pertusio, the shout-out app for industries, businesses, and services. Key Functions of Facilities Management This article finds out how facilities management revolves around four pillars – people, processes, buildings, and technology. Facilities management is a large field with many facets. Whereas a sales manager is directly responsible for sales performance, facilities management tasks go much beyond managing facilities. As a result, firms typically struggle to utilize a good facility manager fully, but how vital is facilities management? It's best to break down what a facilities manager performs, what they're responsible for, and how they impact a company. That involves focusing on people, processes, buildings, and technology. 1. Helping people? A facilities manager's main goal is to make the workplace pleasant for employees. This helps attract and keep top personnel, improve efficiency and production, and foster a healthy workplace culture. Facility managers help employees in numerous ways, such as coordination of desk arrangements, employee directories management, enhancing the use of space and facilitating moves, planning for emergencies. Facility managers act as a link between the workplace and its personnel. The facility management must address issues of accommodation, safety, and comfort. This also applies upward. Facility managers must provide critical data to the C-suite and determine a long-term strategy for workplace improvement. Their daily workplace interactions reveal genuine costs and competitive advantages at the employee level. 2. Developing processes. What are facilities management functions without a process? Processes add structure to the workplace. Order generates a set of expectations, which fosters organization and improves workplace productivity. Workplace processes include requesting work orders. It is possible to reserve space within the facility, taking care of guests and visitors, developing an emergency action plan. Facility managers discover governance gaps and adapt systems to cover them. The facility manager must produce an order from chaos and construct a repeatable framework to handle similar situations in the future. The scope of facility management also extends to developing processes. New processes may involve several departments, workers, assets, fixtures, and places, all of which are interconnected. 3. Maintenance and Renovation of Facilities As the name implies, facility management is founded on building maintenance and enhancement. It's the most typical response to what is facilities management, but it also sets the highest bar for facilities managers. It includes building maintenance, collaborations, future planning, and asset management. Among the many responsibilities are keeping track of vendor contracts, building upkeep and repair, office cleaning and decor, property management on site and off site. If it involves the building, the facilities manager is responsible. A facilities manager's goal is to turn a workplace into a competitive advantage rather than a cost center. It's about making sure facilities satisfy user needs. 4. Integration of Technologies Now more than ever, facility managers must understand and exploit technology. Workplace management systems collect data that informs corporate and workplace choices. Facility managers must identify and implement appropriate technologies. Physical technology integration is usually handled by IT. However, facility managers choose, use, and exploit them. Modern examples of this include investigating IoT devices for data collecting, using IoT devices in routine operations, calculating the value of smart technologies, understanding the workplace with aggregated data. Facility managers can collect and analyze data using an integrated workplace management system. Learn more about IOM software. This improves decision-making about how to improve the work environment for the users. Not all office tech relies on data collection. Access control systems keep people secure while automation speeds up work. While any network device or software contains data, the main usefulness of most tech is in its operation. Understanding and utilizing this function will maximize ROI. 5. Management of Health and Safety The facilities manager is responsible for maintaining the site's safety and health, essential to the department's success. A plethora of laws governs health and safety. Despite this, one of the most important ways the facilities manager helps the core company is by ensuring that the organization remains compliant with that legislation. Failure to comply with health and safety rules can have serious implications. 
Aside from the danger of an employee or visitor is injured or worse, they can include imprisonment, negative publicity, fines, clients lost, loss of employees. Six, management of budgets. The FM must have a budget to manage an efficient FM department. The FM must balance the budget so that there is no negative variance, real spending exceeding receipts. Budget management may be a time-consuming and challenging task, and the FM will frequently collaborate with the finance department to keep the budget on track. The budget will need to include a wide range of factors depending on the type of organization you work for. Conclusion Facility managers help workers in many ways. They create order and structure. Facility managers maintain and improve facilities. They build complicated data linkages to succeed. These four functions offer a picture of what facility managers perform. They optimize the workplace so that it supports every aspect of the business. If you've enjoyed watching this video, then give this video a like and share with a friend. Also click on the subscribe button below to be notified as new videos are released.